Yeah, man. I'm just telling it all. You know what I'm saying? Uh, this shit right here, man. I remember the judge uh, giving me, me those fucking numbers, those fucking football numbers and shit. And I'm like, man. Man, I looked him right in his eye. I'm like, nigga, suck my motherfucking dick, nigga. That's why I told that bitch ass judge. I told that nigga to suck my motherfucking dick. And he was a cracker white motherfucker. So I knew he wanted to give me life anyway. So I, I took it on the chin. I didn't cry like no little bitch like these little bitch ass niggas do when they get life. No, nah, nigga, I told that nigga to suck my dick because I'm going out like a motherfucking G and I know I'm going to be in here for life anyway, motherfucker. I already built my legacy, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Bitch ass niggas. Got a question. Why they count me out? Why they count me out? Man, man, swap be thinking. Why they count me out? Why they count me out? Swap be thinking. In my head. Why they count me out? Why they count me out? Questions in my question now. Why they count me out? Yeah. Cause really all my life it been down With been hella down. people hating, running they mouth running But why they count me out? Count me out. Cause I ain't cloud chasing, chasing clout cloud. Niggas game, I just chose another route yeah. But why they count me, out? count me out? Cause all I ever did is keep it real Get yeah. the skrill and say exactly how what I feel exactly But why they count me, out? count me out? Cause I've never been the type to follow trends yeah. I just keep it G and focus on my ends Cause why they count me out? The American system has always been one big joke to me. And there's no merit behind it. Fucking courts, lawyers, judges, laughing at the fact that nigga behind bars. Fuck all of them. So what you wanna know? I'm a notorious Cecil Ducksworth. And did a lot of shit that I'm not proud of, but it is what it is. That's why I'm here. That's why I'm in here for the rest of my life. Anybody that's slanging, that's doing this shit, that's in this shit something heavy, that's in the game really, really deep, I just want you to step back, go inside the fucking restroom, go inside your restroom, and sit in that very restroom for 24 hours. When you pull that trigger or when you make that next step, that's gonna determine your entire life for the next 25 years I want you to go in that restroom first and sit for 24 hours I want you to sit for 24 hours think Cause that's what I gotta do I gotta sit in this fucking prison all day every day this shit ain't life it ain't I'm constantly reliving these thoughts in my mind, the good times that I never get back. It's tough. To the youth, to the youth, nigga, I would say just don't get caught. You get caught, you're going to be in here with me. And I ain't going to lie, man, you know, fuck from just balling, spending money, having hella cars, women. It, it just ain't worth it, man. You know, because when you get behind these prison walls, this is all you see. This is all you see. And it's it's very depressing. You know, um, there's been times where I actually cried, man. I actually cried myself to sleep, wondering if I ever would 
the get out, man. And when you're behind these prison walls, it's like, it's almost like you're your own worst enemy. You end up being trapped in your own thoughts. I didn't have plenty of nights where I was just totally against myself. And I wanted to just fucking, just fucking end it all, slip my wrist. I wanted to do it. Man, I just, man, I just need to get out of here, man. Fuck. And the sad thing about all this, the sad thing about all this is that there were people in my life that wanted me to change. That wanted me to change. And I didn't listen. The sad thing about all this is I didn't listen. Now I'm stuck in here, man. They told me to slow down. They told me to get out the game. But I didn't listen. And now I'm just in here, man. I'm in here and I, I'm trapped. I'm trapped inside my thoughts. I know I'm never getting out, man. It is, it's, it's so tough that I'll never be able to to see my son. I'll never be able to watch him grow up. <laughs> Cut the camera off, man. I'm done. This interview, this interview's done, man. Please. Yeah, man. I, I think one of the things that hurt me the most uh, when was when I got set up by my homie, you know what I'm saying? We go back, man. Uh, my Jamaican homie, he set me up, and I was really trying to put him on at the time. You know, I was really trying to put him on, getting out, get him out on his field, get his feet wet. But somehow, like I was saying, man, it's just the jealous jealousy, man. It controlled your mind. So whether it be a friend or a foe, it don't matter. When when that jealousy take takes over your heart, you don't see nothing but but jealousy and hate. And that's what he's seen with me, man. He wanted my spot. He wanted to be at the top. And I remember putting him on, giving him a couple stacks, you know what I'm saying? But somehow, this motherfucker didn't think it was enough, you know? He didn't think it was enough, a little greedy bitch. And um, he just, bitch ass nigga, uh, he called me. He, he actually called me and he had me pull up to the spot and meet him. And I'm like, yeah, cool, cool, homie, I'm on my way. So I'm chilling in my motherfucking ride, pulling up, you know what I'm saying? Not thinking nothing of me and the homie. This nigga come out with the strap to my head, talking about, nigga, get out the car. Nigga, fuck you. Nigga, I'm the motherfucking man now. I'm the motherfucking man. And shit, nigga, throw me out the car. Nigga, pistol with me. Man, you just see the jealousy and the hate and the frustration in his voice. Man, I I couldn't believe it, man. I was just so fucking hurt, man. And you know what I'm saying? I, I spoke my little shit. I just couldn't believe it, you know? I couldn't believe this nigga went that far. And um, he said, he said his fucking words to me. And you know what I'm saying? That was it. After that, fuck, he unloaded on me. He unloaded on me to the point where I'm like, what the fuck? Is this really happening? All I could envision in my life was, nigga, I'm fucking dead, bro. I was, I was on that ground fucking bleeding to death. You know what I'm saying? Hey, my boy Cecil. My boy Cecil, take care of me. Hey yo, Caesar, what's up, brother? Hey, bro, I heard you was the plug and you're back on again. Hey, we go way back, brother. Can you hook me up? Hey, look, man, don't even worry. We got we got everything taken care of, bro. Hey, I did hear what you and D Train did to that boy. You knocked him, boy. You knocked him. Congratulations. <laughs> yeah, but hey, won't you pull up, bro? Yeah, yeah. Deja.
cut stand that damn prick anyway. Season. Sound like an old zip boat anyway. Put a hole in that motherfucking zip boat. Yeah, bring these big chats around. <laughs> I work for D Rod, bitch. I'ma put a fucking bullet in your fucking face. <laughs> Make sure you won't breathe. You blood clot you? You blood clot you? I take this gun and go boom. <laughs> Bitch ass nigga. Boy, boy, I see your season. Still making that damn business, boy. What's up, my nigga? Shit. shit. Same shit, different toilet, man. Oh, man. Shit. Hey, you mind talking to me? I What's need up? some of that 20, man. I need 20, some 100, something, man. Help a brother out. <laughs> boy, oh boy, hey, Caesar, my boy. Hey, you always take care of me. We take care of each other. Yeah, I feel you, my nigga. Shit, we in it to win it, bro. Shit, you know I got you, fam. We didn't put in a lot of work together. Oh, God, you know? oh, God. You know what's Appreciate going down on these streets, man. You oh, know I you knocked that motherfucker know. off. You man. already know, bro. Right, right. You already know. Fuck everyone. Listen, man. I'm gonna give you a couple stacks so you can re up real fast, but after that, man, I want you to work for me, man. You know what I'm saying? Because we making real motherfucking moves. It's lightweight, baby. You know what I'm saying? You gotta get it. Because there's a lot of motherfuckers out here that want to take me out, and I can't have that shit. So I need real better motherfuckers like you on my team. For sure, bro. For sure. I got you. You know what I'm saying? We trying to take over the city, baby. Fuck these niggas. For sure. You know what I got you, bro. You know, we go way back. Like four fight Cadillacs. What the fuck am I talking about, my nigga? Shit. Well, help me, brothers. What would you give me? Man, there's a couple stacks you can flip. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna contact you with my plugs and shit. And you gonna double that shit up, man. All right, I got double you. Double that shit up. I'm gonna hang on to the rest of it because I gotta make some motherfucking real moves. All right, man. You stay up. I catch you around. See you around like a donut. Sizzle again, boy. Hey, yo, Sizzle. Huh, I did the work, boy. You already know I'm good. Hey, can you pull up at the spot? We gotta meet. We gotta link, man. Huh. All right. Smoke the shit out of this bitch. I'm tired of working for others. You know, come with my own crew. Do a little bit more better. <laughs> Cecil D train. Taiwan. It'll be the end of them. I'll make sure. <laughs> Motherfucker. Be polite or you're dying. Yo, get your fuck out that motherfucking car, bitch! Fuck out that motherfucking car, motherfucker! The fuck out the car! Get out the motherfucking car, motherfucker! You think I got more time than a little bit? Get your motherfucking bitch ass up! Your bitch ass nigga! 
tired of you giving me sneaky ass motherfucking two dollars, two hundred dollars. Give me my leashes. Where's my money? Over me when we were younger. We could go with. I still had your back. When motherfuckers robbed you, I had your back. And you gonna do some lame shit like that to me? And getting me fucking a few fucking dollars and I told you I was hurting? You hurt me, man. And now you must pay. Be polite or you'll die. Who are you to decide on who lives or dies? <laughs> Just little bitch ass niggas like yourself. You will never survive out here, see, so by yourself. So you can talk to D Train or Taiwan, send him a fucking message. I'm trusting you! I'm trusting you! You, you bitch. Do it! I said do it! Fuck, kill me! Do it! <laughs> I deserve it! I deserve everything I get! I never knew! I never was thought! It'd be you! It'd be you to send me straight to hell! Do it! Fucking kill me! I deserve it. I I don't know. I don't know. But do you think I really give a fuck? You never gave a fuck. You treated me like you, I was your motherfucking slave. Gave me piece to piece. Back to back and forth. And you sit there and think that you a fucking did something? It took you five or seven years to Put me on. Put me on. <sighs> motherfucker, you giving me motherfucking food and calling it shit and telling me it's motherfucking dinner. And you think I will give a fuck about a little nigga like you? Jealous motherfucking oh, snake! You bitch ass nigga. See you in hell.
shit, I had everything set up. One thing about us is uh, you either rob us, uh, you steal from us, you do anything to hurt the financial flow of our business, shit, we're going to come at you. Hmm, <laughs> shit, right or wrong, you know, um, we're going to fuck you up. And that's just what's real. Yep. Can a nigga pray to ever tell you that I am dead shit? I'm the type of nigga go zero to a hundred real quick. Real quick. Real quick. I'm the type of nigga go zero to a hundred real quick. Can a nigga breathe to ever tell you that I never did shit? I'm the type of nigga go zero to a hundred real quick. Real quick. Real quick. I'm the type of nigga go zero to a hundred real quick. Can a nigga breathe to ever tell me that I never did shit? I'm the type of nigga go zero to a hundred real quick. Real quick. Real quick. Real quick. Type of nigga go zero to a hundred real quick. It's right, that's when I flow, cause I'm just super strong. I'm the type of nigga that I cock back and I shoot your car. I'm the type of nigga that I cock back and I shoot your car. I'm the type of nigga that I cock back and I shoot your car. I'm the type of nigga that I cock back and I shoot your car. I'm the type of nigga that I cock back and I shoot your car. I'm the type of nigga that I cock back and I shoot your car. I'm the type of nigga that I cock back and I shoot your car. I'm the type of nigga that I cock back and I told you I was coming back for that ass. You should have killed me if you had the chance. Hmm. Looks like the work is done. Fucking with the fam. Make sure to get your ass fucking popped. Bitch ass nigga. Yo. Finish that shit, bro. Fuck, I'm talking about my nigga. Yeah, hold that for me. I'm gonna get out of here. Get the fuck up out of here. You ever been down? You ever been down? You ever been up? You ever been up? Times get hard. Times get hard. But you can't give up. There's times where uh, I be hot behind these fucking walls, just going crazy, man, really spazzing out. Because you, cause you gotta understand, when you come from a life of kicking it. A life of just getting money and, uh, you know, dealing with multiple women. You know what I'm saying? And you, you, you like really the shit out here. You like really the motherfucking man, you know? And you come a life, you come from that type of lifestyle and you get in a mix where these fucking guards and, you know, everybody just telling you what to do, when to go to sleep. Uh, when to wash your ass, uh, you know, all types of shit, you know, these punk ass guards, you know, they'll talk crazy to you and shit, dude, you, you barely even see the sunlight, you barely even see the sunlight in this motherfucker, man, you know, it's crazy, I can't even call it, man, I can't even call how uh, many sleepless nights I didn't have just down there going crazy in this motherfucker, man, and just stinking, just basically trapped in my own thoughts I mean if you want to call it that just trapped in your own thoughts and uh don't get me wrong you know um, shit gets lonely you know what I'm saying you know it's just like don't get me wrong fuck man you know I got my niggas in here and shit but what the fuck man it's crazy bro you know just Knowing that I'm being this motherfucker for the rest of my life is just, just damn near fucking insane, man. I, I don't even, I can't even call it, man.
grandiose like his cute pulling chain on the gang. I seen the hardest of goons, a million dollar tycoon taking orders when they eat, when the shit on the stoop. You think this cool triple O? I'm keep it real with you, man. You never hear these niggas spitting about the start of the game. You think this cool triple O? I'm keep it real with you, man. You never hear these niggas spitting about the start of the game. I'm a thumb in the game. I'm a thumb, thumb, thumb. Without a finger on the ground, stealing dumb, dumb, dumb. They hold a beat so the bottle want a mix of yo. Collect big face vintage on that tens and ones. The pop a rubber band, gotta be a thumb, man. And be a silver by gorilla with a fox brain slide. Man, I never thought I'd be behind these prison walls. I went to fucking bitches, getting money, to being trapped inside a fucking prison all by myself. Nothing but my thoughts. It's crazy how life works. We get so cocky and arrogant, we don't realize the fact that it could happen to us. We could be locked up. I ain't going down without a fight. I'm praying to God every night, crying every night. I promise I need to get out this motherfucker. I'm going crazy. Trapped inside my thoughts. At that time, I began to hallucinate. See, I was in that damn cell dancing with the devil. He was sending his demons after me. See, demons coming after you when you're at your most vulnerable, most weakest state. It's fucked up. I had no privacy. I felt like my soul was sinking to the ground. You have no privacy cameras watching you. Your every move. I wanted to die. Help me change my ways. I beg of you. I want this Bible in my head. God, please. God, please help me change my ways. I'm a lost soul. I'm a lost soul, Lord. I started off grinding hard. I was initiated into the motherfucking game and that was it. I was stuck. 
motherfuckers will always try to tell me to slow down and you know stop doing all this crazy shit but I wasn't trying to hear that shit man you know I was a hard headed motherfucker and you know um I was hard headed I ain't gonna lie I was hard headed and it was fuck everybody and I was only in it for myself I used a lot of people uh, for my own personal use you know um I put in the work, me and my niggas would put in the work, but you know what I'm saying? I would get what I get out of them too, you know? It is what it is, you know? Um, I wasn't an angel, I wasn't a saint. I was actually a shady motherfucker. And I believe if I wouldn't be behind these prison walls right now, I'd probably be dead, you know what I'm saying? Like, real talk, I think a motherfucker would have, you know, just ended my life because I didn't had so many uh, fucking close calls out here on the streets it's not even funny you know so I thank God that I'm actually in here because uh, shit I could be dead shit I could even be dead in here you know nigga, niggas come out and shank me you know but it is what it is if it's my time to go it's my time to go you know like you can't live your life in fear a scared man can't win you know what I'm saying shit so um take it on the chin baby Take it on the chin. You got to do what you got to do. And you, as a man, you got to stand on your own two feet. Right or right or wrong, you know. Evidently, I was in the wrong because I'm in this motherfucker. But, shh, you know, um, keep your head up. You know what I'm saying? Uh, life is going to deal you some cards you ain't ready for. It's just how you take it, you know. So, uh, uh, you do the crime. Do the time. Don't fucking snitch. Just take it on the chin. And I'd be a man about them to sit down, you know what I'm saying? Hello? Hey, bro, get me back. I'm handling business. I'm handling motherfucking business right now. I ain't got time for that shit. I hit you up, man. You already know what's up, cuz. So we do things around here, baby. Should be in it to win it. You know what I'm saying? Hey, hey, I'm gonna get you back. Cars in the middle of the street and shit. We get you back, fam. Like, that's all we do is count the cheese. That's all we do. That's all we do is count big shit, my nigga. That's all we do. You know, we count stacks on them, man. Listen, if you wanna fuck with me, you gotta prove yourself to me. Shit. This ain't no game. Shit. I don't want no snitch in my motherfucking group. You gotta prove yourself to me, man. You know what I'm saying? I fuck with D-Train. I fuck with all the big balls. You know, niggas don't like me. Fuck it. Bitches don't like me. Fuck them. You know what I'm saying? I don't need that shit, buddy. You know? Stay grinding out here, man. What's up, cuz? Oh, shit. Hey, fuck you been at, nigga? Man, what's up, cuz? Where you been at all these years? Hey, motherfucking Will Eddie, man. Yeah. What's up, man? What's I ain't seen you in a minute, man. man. Shit, how you doing, I'm man? On this kid shit, you know? See, I see you had them business like a real motherfucker. Right, right, right. You had them business like a real motherfucker. Yes, yeah, sir. Had to right. hang the gloves up, you know? Yeah, man. You was out here something tough. Some. You was oh, out yeah. here something tough, G. Yes, yeah, sir. You know it. Hey, but respect, homie. Yeah, Kids will make you get out the yeah, game. Sir. You know what I'm doing, homie. I want you to hold on this shit, man. You know, this shit means nothing. You know what I'm saying? This yes, shit means nothing, man. You know what I'm saying? You got a beautiful family, you know? Little extra shit, man. You know? Beautiful family, man. You gonna tuck this shit away? You know, shit is hectic out here, cuz. You know, tie it on down, man. Get something else going, bro. It's worth it no more, man. We willing to be It's rough out here, son. We ain't got too many niggas left, bro. Man, what do you mean by something else, man? These niggas out here tripping, man. You look at them wrong, bro. We don't want that shit. You know what? Fuck these niggas out here. You know what I'm saying? Fuck about it. These motherfuckers are going to have to kill me. You know what I'm saying? I ain't going to lay on my ground like a coward. You know what I'm saying? It's money. Money over everything, my nigga. Money over everything. You yes, know what sir. I'm saying? I already know. I ain't gonna fold. You know they gotta shoot me. Dead. Yeah, we don't want that dog. You can't lose my nigga. You can't lose OG. Dang, dang. OG cease the beast. Right, lose right. Him. Cease the beast. We can't win. Lose him. Hey, we win every time, baby. Yes, sir. See, the fact of the matter is, you know, we stay at the top. So these little hate motherfuckers, these little hate motherfuckers hating on this guac, hating on this flag, hating on this color. Shit, this is what I die for. Yeah, man. Shh. I remember me and my nigga D train, we marked this motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? Um I think 
you know, and ultimately that would come back on me too, because motherfucker we murked was this nigga named T.Y. That was his cousin or his brother. I, I don't know who the fuck it was, but I know he was like kin to him. And that started like a whole nother beef, a whole nother motherfucking rivalry. Cause uh, that nigga T.Y., no doubt, um, he was just gangster as me. He's actually get locked up as we speak right now. So uh, both of us is off the streets, you know, for real. I, I didn't know the nigga was gonna survive that shit. You know what I'm saying? Shit. I had that nigga knocked off. I had that motherfucking nigga T.Y. knocked off. You know what I'm saying? I had him knocked off. And tsh, I talked my little shit in his fucking face. You know what I'm saying? Left him for dead. Nigga, you gonna make me kill you next, Renny. I swear to God. Even though I fucking love you, nigga, because you've been a part of my family forever, nigga. You gonna make me kill you, nigga. Yeah, so your motherfucking phone. This bitch ass nigga's gonna kill my little brother and think the shit's sweet, nigga. Nigga, what the fuck is a D train, nigga? What the fuck is a D train, nigga? I got a D train for that nigga, bitch. That's what the fuck I got, nigga. Man, I swear to God, this nigga Cecil really think he that nigga, bro. Bro, Rennie, answer the fucking phone. Yo, Rennie. It's T.Y. Nah, 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 nah. Nah, I need a favor. I need a favor, nigga. Like, this is, this is like red light favor, nigga. Like, you remember that 20K I stashed? Under my bed. Yeah, I need you to go grab that. I need you to go buy you a first class ticket, all right? I need you to get to Kansas, like ASAP. Just go get that 20, buy you a ticket, get the fuck out of here, all right? Real talk, real talk. I'll explain the rest of the details to you, bro, when you get out here. Nah, real talk, I'll explain the rest of the motherfucking details, bro, you asking too many fucking questions. Just get the cash, I already got the charter plane ready for you. Get there. Tell Uncle Wayne. Get your ass on the plane and get you to motherfucking Kansas. All right? Cool. I'm No, we're not talking no more, bro. We're not talking no more. It's just green lights. It's green lights all around. Nigga, these niggas didn't kill my little brother, bro. It's green lights all the way the fuck around. Not you, bro, bro. All the niggas they could have killed, bro, they killed you. You, my nigga? All these niggas. All these niggas, bro. Fuck out of here, sister. I can see you, bro. This nigga think this shit is a game, bro. <laughs> fuck that shit, you think this shit is a game, bro? Man, you must have forgot who the fuck I really am, bro. I'm the prince of New York, nigga. I'm the fucking prince of New York, nigga. Ah. Fucking prince of New York shit, nigga. This nigga had my uncle killed. I had my brother killed. I'm gonna kill you, Jesus.
<laughs> I'm gonna fucking kill you, Cecil. Oh, I'm gonna kill you. I'm gonna have to fuck you up. What's up, Cecil? Hey, bro, you remember that nigga you was talking about? Hey, what do he look like? Okay, so he black. Is he like dark or is he like brown? Oh, he dark. Okay, okay. What else he look like? He got like a little beard, or such. Big ass nose. All right, bro. Hey, bro, I'm around the neighborhood, so if I see this nigga, I'm gonna let you know. Sergeant, now, in and out, in and out. I fucking wanna play with Cecil. I told these niggas, man. I told these niggas, man. I'm coming to cap every motherfucking bro. Like that nigga right there. Shit. Hold up. This nigga Cecil. Quick. Niggas, bro. These niggas think they ain't gonna die today, huh? <laughs> Kill my little brother and don't think you gonna die. Guys. They act like bastards. <laughs> That's facts, nigga. They do act like bastards, nigga. Hey, see. What that nigga look like again? Hey, bro, I think I see this nigga right here. Hey, bro, I'm going to call you back as soon as I get done handling this shit. I got you. In and out. In and out. I killed my little brother, nigga. Fuck these niggas, dog. These niggas think I'm sweating these niggas, dog. Hey, bro, what's up, Cecil? Hey, bro, I'm gonna call you back as soon as I get done handling this shit. I don't think they know that shit, bro. I don't think they know that shit. I don't think they know they're gonna die today. It's too hot. Fuck that shit, bro. Piss me the fuck off. Hey, T1! T1, bitch ass nigga, T1! Cecil sent me, nigga! <laughs> Fuck the church. Nigga, here, fuck nigga. you, bitch ass nigga. <laughs> well, you at least gotta see my face. Oh, I gotta see you. Sergeant out. Fuck ass nigga. You already know Cecil World out here. We go to any block, any territory, any gang, we take everything. I've been telling niggas this since day one. Now you see him what the fuck I'm talking about. Cecil World out here, nigga. Now you sleep, bitch. Fucking baby asleep. 
The sleep motherfucker. Yeah. I've been dreaming for this day, motherfucker. I've been dreaming for this shit. Fucking sleeping motherfucking baby. That's what you get when you cross game, motherfucker. Chance to kill. Wake up. Wake up. Sad thing about this shit is your motherfucking uncle died the same way. It's ironic, ain't it? Just think of me as the motherfucking devil. I just send you to be with your uncle. You should be thanking me. Go to sleep, bitch. Man, it's hard to get out the game, man. Especially if you got a girlfriend and she's constantly yamming on you just to get the fuck out and you just a hard-headed motherfucker like man fuck this i'ma keep banging you know what i'm saying you know some, sometimes god pick, cause puts people in our life for a reason sometimes it's that little bird in our ear that keeps telling us hey get out the game get out the game but we don't even listen it could be a girlfriend or a shit it could be one of your friends uh close family members, or it could be a motherfucker you don't even know. It could be a motherfucker you, you look down on telling you to get out, but you just so stupid and arrogant that you just like, man, fuck you. You know what I'm saying? All that dumb shit. But in reality, when you look back and you think about that situation, you like, damn, maybe I should have listened to her. Maybe I should have listened to this young nigga trying to spit a little bit of knowledge to me, but nah. I know everything. I'm the motherfucking boss. I can't be touched. I can't be this. I, you know, all this bullshit that you thinking in your head. You know what I'm saying? That you the man. You know, but in reality, man, God puts people in your life to tell you certain things. And it's up to you whether you want to listen or not. Because if you don't, shit, the consequences can be deadly. Or once again, like I keep saying, you can't be in here with me with a group full of niggas getting told what to do you know what i'm saying you can't do what you want in here not like that <laughs> shit nigga you know what i'm saying gang i'm sorry so uh when somebody is just trying to uh preach that word to you or you know just give you a little advice about you know maybe stepping out or you know just kind of slowing you down just kind of slowing it down just a tad just a tad a little bit motherfucker take that advice Take it. Man. I'm a thumb, 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 I'm
No, get rid of all this shit. Fuck all this shit. Fuck all this shit. I don't want none of this shit. Fuck this. Fuck you if you're still doing that same shit. Fuck you. Fuck you. Where are you still doing that drug dealing shit? No, fuck this, bro. Get rid of it. Get the fuck rid of it. I don't want it. No, you're not getting me in trouble. I have a job. No, 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 no. No, I'm not. I have a job. I, I can't be getting in trouble for this shit. I can't be risking my job for this shit. Get rid of that shit. This is a whole like six months paychecks for you, and I get that in a day. Get the fuck rid of it. You gonna have to do something else with that attitude. No, 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 no. I'm not doing shit with the attitude. We're, we can get in trouble. We can go to prison for this shit. I'm not doing this. Nobody's scared no fucking. Prison. You're not doing this shit. No, get rid of it. Go give it back to whoever. I don't give a fuck. Give it back to. Whoever. What I'm gonna do? Take the drugs back? Yes. Say, you're gonna, I, yes. You're gonna get rid of this. You're gonna anymore, get so rid of this. Look here. I don't want this shit. You know that's just mad disrespect. You can go to hell. The money can go. I don't want none of that shit. Yeah. Yeah? Well, yeah. you don't want it, why the fuck yeah. you still here? But I love you, I just don't want to see you do anything crazy. I mean, I understand that. But at the same time, I'm trying to make sure you good, though. I feel like you don't love me, because if you love me, you wouldn't be doing this. I mean, I don't know why you think I don't, though. I'm not here doing it for us. Well, I don't care. I don't us. care about materialistic. I just want us to be safe. And you're not putting me in a safe environment. You're putting me in a very dangerous environment. Do I have any drugs around you? You have drugs. I mean, drug we smoke, money, but that's babe. it. I got drug money, but that's it, though. That's still bad. I mean, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Me, me and Six are going to get some money regardless. So you're not going to listen to me? I didn't say I'm not listening, but I hear what you're saying, though. No, you don't. I mean, that's how you feel. I mean, but you got my money on the brain. Like, I ain't work hard for this, though. You talking about getting a 9 to 5. This is my 9 to 5. Well, that's I the fruit of my labor right here on the floor. Well, I don't want to see you go to prison or anything. I ain't worried about that. Just get, get a regular job, that's all I'm asking. I just love you, I just want to see you do good in life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know? Look, I told you, it ain't it ain't nothing that's permanent with this, so. But it is, baby. Like, you don't know what you're getting yourself into. I mean, yeah, everybody gets caught eventually, baby. Everybody might get yeah. caught, but I'm not, though. I'm not everybody. I move smart though. Well, you know, I just, I just want the best for you. Like, I don't want you to go to prison or anything. You know? I mean, I understand that, but I'm a drug dealer. I don't want you to be a drug dealer. Hey, me and Cecil, like I said, don't get this bread. Me and Cecil, me and Cecil. That's all you keep saying. Fuck, fuck him. Doesn't matter. You tell to my bills. So. You can pay your bills, babe. Like I'll, I'll even help you pay your bills. Like I'll pitch in. But can you just please stop this? I'll do anything. I just want you to stop this. Like yo, you have to stop me though. Huh? You have to stop me though. Yeah. Why? Because I don't want you doing this stupid shit. Yeah, and I love you, so it's tough love, babe. Is it? The streets. streets need me. No, they don't. I need you. Bro, I told you, I already been to jail you and all should, that. You should care more. Like, you should care about me. Like, this puts me in an uncomfortable situation. I can't sleep comfortably. Like, how am I supposed to do anything? The cops could be following me anywhere. Like, how I need you to understand something. I'm doing this for us, and I'm gonna stop, alright? I ain't gonna keep doing it. You promise you're gonna stop? Yeah, I'm gonna promise I'm gonna stop. And I know you've been giving me this tough love, smacking me and shit. But yeah, because it's, cool. it's bullshit, babe. Give you this. Pick up that money. Mm -hmm. I gotta drop a package off, alright? Okay. And after that, I'm gonna be done. Are is you that cool? sure? The last time. This is the last time. Yeah. Okay, you promise? You think you promise me? Love you, baby. Yeah, man. Uh, sh shit, I, I done been caught slipping many a times, man. Many a times, you know. And, and sometimes it be when I least suspect it. Sometimes I, it be when I least suspect it, man. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, on streets, I was, I was a cocky motherfucker, man. Well respected, but I was cocky. I felt like I couldn't be touched. And it took that one motherfucker to catch me slipping. T.Y. And that motherfucker, he really let me have it. I ain't gonna lie. This bitch ass nigga really, 
uh, put the hurting on me. I don't know where the fuck he came from, but this motherfucker came out of nowhere with the motherfucking pistol and right over my head. And shit, this man, this motherfucker, man. It's a, by the grace of God, I'm still alive, man. I was pissed. I was, I was pissed, man. I, I definitely wanted revenge, man. Shit. You know, he shot me up a couple times, man. I managed to survive that shit, you know, barely. Barely managed to survive in hospital beds and shit and ER, uh, losing hella blood. And it was fucking crazy, you know. There's fucking cops everywhere, ambulances everywhere, man. All I could think of at that particular time was fucking murking this motherfucker. Really can't believe they killed my nigga, though. They really killed my nigga. All over a bitch nigga named Cecil. All over a bitch nigga named Cecil. And then last week, I still can't get this shit out of my head. Last week, I got pistol whipped by a bitch nigga named Lionel. Somebody's got to die for this. That's my grandfather would always tell me. Somebody's got to pay the Pod Piper. Somebody's got to pay him. If not one of them, both of them. Got me fucked up as a matter of fact. Who the fuck is this sliding up over here? What the fuck? Alright fam. Alright fam, I'ma holler at you. I'ma holler at you, baby. Yeah, that's it, come on, pull off. Y'all don't need to see y'all nigga die. That's not a good sight. There you go. Good, good, good. Alright. Like I said, man, we just took care of one of these bitch ass niggas that robbed my homie, man. You know what I'm saying? That's where motherfuckers slip at. They can't cross game. Motherfuckers cross game, motherfuckers get killed. They know who the fuck Cecil and D Train Sarge are? Yeah. That's the whole game plan with these bitch ass niggas, man. Always want to cross game, motherfucker, get out of that straight knot. Yeah, nigga, I'm just on my way back to the pad, man. We did that shit earlier this morning, man. We took care of the motherfucking trash. Cause that's what these niggas are. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, hey, my nigga, I'm, I'm here, nigga. I'm at the spot, nigga. No. Oh, trash, nigga. Who the fuck you think you is, nigga? <laughs> nigga, don't worry, bro. Hey, hey, nigga. Fuck you. Nigga, who the fuck is trash, nigga? Who the fuck is this train, bro? Who the fuck is this train, nigga? Why oh, you had that nigga smoke my little brother? Huh? I brought my little brother here from fucking New York to make some money, nigga. And you bitch ass niggas don't hate on him and smoke him. That motherfucker robbed me, train, you bitch. Fuck up, nigga. Don't give a fuck about none of that, nigga. We heard you robbed our uncle two years ago for that cocaine you went down for. You remember that shit? Cecil? Hey, 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 nigga. I don't got it. What the fuck is you doing? What the fuck are you doing, son? Bitch ass stuff, nigga. Come on, nigga. Come on, nigga. Come on, nigga. Don't try. Don't try anything stupid, bro. I'm trying anything stupid, alright? I'm trying nothing stupid. I'm already mad right now. Come on. Let's take your ass one. Hey, hey, hey. That's what I'm doing. Shut the fuck up, nigga. You're fucking dead. Hey, nigga. Stop moving too much for me, nigga. Get your fuck ass in there. Death is us all, Cecil. It hits us all. I don't think anybody ever told you that. But I'm death whispering in your ear, buddy. You ever heard the sound of a clip drop? Before it's getting ready to be dropped on you. Too bad you gotta fill the whole clip today. Cause death hits us all. Sometimes it's an eye for an eye. Cause I didn't fuck motherfuckers over too, man. We didn't, we didn't got over so, over so many people. We didn't uh, set motherfuckers up. Uh, got these niggas hooked on drugs. Niggas that used to be at the top of their game and shit. We didn't got them hooked on drugs on purpose. Just to 
turn these niggas into junkies. Because I look at it this way, man. Me and my niggas, we were scandalous. We were scandalous as fuck. Any nigga that we thought that was a motherfucking threat, we would take them out. Whether it be killing these niggas, uh, slowly snaking these niggas and befriending them, befriending them, and then just let them set them up on some junkie type shit, you know, whether we gotta force the drugs down they throat or just get them hooked regardless or whatever the fuck, you know what I'm saying, we did whatever the fuck we had to do uh, to get these niggas out the game and sometimes uh, that shit even came back on me, man, it's uh, 4TY is the smoker nigga named Lionel, you know, he, that nigga used to be on his grind too, but like I said, uh, uh, like, he was a threat to me on the money tip because we was getting money he was getting money so i'm like man it can't be both of us getting money you know what i'm saying fuck this nigga so me and d train set that nigga up got him hooked up on that like, we got him hooked on the powder you know we got him hooked on that shit sniff sniff yeah all types of shit yeah yeah we got him hooked on that shit and um it is what it is you know I'll take that little man. You know what I'm saying? Thank you. 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 you. know what I'm saying? I know you seem, it seems like a lot right now, but trust me, it's gonna be nothing. It's just a piece of what I got, fam. I think I got a lot right now. This ain't nothing to me, bro. That's why I'm breaking you off, son. That's just pocket change, you feel me? I'm trying to get you right and get this pocket change, too. Cigarette. Cigarette! Cecil 
ever since then, he's just never been the same. He's been homeless, going through the motions, lost everything. And along the way, gained some mental problems. top of this game to become a motherfucking junkie digging out the trash and all that motherfucker could say what's our names nigga Cecil D train I'm like this fucking crackhead ass nigga you know what I'm saying but it is what it is that bitch ass nigga done did a lot of shit too you know he used to beat on his girlfriend that nigga used to beat on this motherfucking girlfriend you know what I'm saying you know and me and D train um you know we get a lot of women. We respect, like, we would never hit on our girlfriends. And uh, word got out on the street. That nigga was doing that. And we wasn't about to have that. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, hey, D-Train, let's, um, let's set this nigga up. He already competition, but let's just um, reel this nigga in, get him, hooked on, get him hooked in on some drugs. You know what I'm saying? And just um, uh, turn this motherfucker into a straight junkie. And exactly what we did. And on the outside looking in, I don't know where the fuck that nigga's at now, but shit, and you know, um, we kind of took it personally um, when we heard he was just hitting on his woman and shit, and you know, um, we already wanted to knock that nigga off anyway, so we just did it in the slowest way, you know what I'm saying, we wanted that nigga to die slow, so it is what it is, shit, we was fucked up, we was fucked up out here, man, I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. And really, shit, them junkies? Shit, them niggas deadly. Them, when, when niggas get hooked on that shit, they turn into motherfucking dope fiends and they doped out all them motherfucking drugs. Them niggas will kill you within a heartbeat. Them niggas is deadly. So even though Lino turned into a motherfucking junkie, Afterwards, that motherfucker was still deadly, and we kind of still had to watch our back, me and D Train, because I don't think tsh, niggas run up and smoke, even fucking junkies. <laughs> Shit. I don't know where the fuck that nigga's at right now, you know what I'm saying? Probably dead or somewhere, man. Maybe he got his act together. I don't know. Shit. Fuck that nigga, though. <laughs> I'm gonna kill him, bro. I'm gonna kill him. I'm gonna kill him, niggas, bro.
Yeah! 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 Man, this motherfucker, bro, like, I ain't gonna lie, man. I used to be, like, one of them pretty boy motherfuckers, you know what I'm saying? Like, really out here when I was younger and shit, like, the fresh hair cut, all that bullshit, you know, all the shit the bitches, like, you know, I was a clean motherfucker, I was a real classy, clean motherfucker, you know, I always got hella money, I always had hella women at these parties and shit, I always had a nice clean shave and shit. But, nigga, when I really started trapping and shit, you know what I'm saying? It's just like, shit, bro. It's like, fuck. It's almost like, man, I look at some of my older pictures now, man, and I don't even fucking recognize myself, man. I'm like, what the fuck? Who is it? Who is this nigga? I'm like, nigga, who is this pretty motherfucker right here? Nigga looks soft, you know what I'm saying? So, I didn't even recognize myself, man. I was like, like I said, man, I was a real uh, flashy, flamboyant type dude, you know what I'm saying? And just, you know, real ladies man type of nigga. But, you know, I got in here, man, shit. Well, man, nigga, look, let's just say... I ain't had a haircut, nigga, in like five years, nigga. It's been like five years, nigga, since I had a motherfucking haircut in this bitch. That's how you know I don't really give a fuck, you know what I'm saying? Just fuck the world, you know what I'm saying? Because, shit, when you, when you inside this motherfucker, you disconnected from the world. You disconnected from women, everything. You ain't got nothing, shit. You just got these punk-ass guards and these bitch ass niggas and I ain't about to you know what I'm saying I'd rather masturbate before I even go down that booty warrior shit you know what I'm saying fuck that so you know it is what it is you know I'm just in here man you know hoping I can get out but I know that shit ain't gonna happen so um it's cool I done had plenty of women to the point where I can just go in my mind and just um maybe jack off or something, stroke my meat a little bit and just be like, oh shit, you know what I'm saying? So, uh, no complaints, you know, um, no complaints, you know, but I would never go down that path of just being a straight out fucking bitch boy, putting Kool-Aid on his motherfucking lips, sucking dick, uh, turning a homo thug type of ass nigga, you know what I'm saying? I'll never go down that path because that ain't me, you know what I'm saying? You want to kill me, motherfucker, before that shit even happened, nigga, you know what I'm saying? Or even if that motherfucker, that shit better not even cross your mind, my nigga, you know what I'm saying? Because if it do, nigga, if I even catch you even thinking about that shit, nigga. I'm rip your motherfucking eyeballs out. How about that, nigga? You know what I'm saying? That's how serious I am about that shit, my nigga. But on the other tip, um, yeah, I just can't go down that path. I done seen a lot of niggas do it too. You know what I'm saying? A lot of motherfuckers go down that homo path and all that shit in here, and I'm like, man, you niggas, you know, do what you do, man. You know what I'm saying? Do what you do. Just don't bring that shit my way or you gonna get fucked up. Fucking bitch ass niggas. But live my life, I just wanna do it right. I just wanna live my life. I just wanna do it right. I just wanna live my life. I just wanna do it right. When you game banging and shit, you so blinded by the fact of just uh, the cockiness, the arrogance, everything, the guns, the money. And you don't realize that you're killing yourself in the long run. You know what I'm saying? You're, you're actually killing yourself. You are your own worst enemy. So when you point that gun at the rival or when you, when you kill that, that gang rival or whatever the fuck you want to call it, your nemesis, Man, look at it this way, bro. You really killing your fucking self. You know what I'm saying? Because when you pull that trigger, man, you're taking somebody else's life. You know what I'm saying? Right or wrong, you took somebody to life. So, imagine you pointing that trigger at yourself, taking your own life. Because if you get caught, if you get caught, or even if it's on your heart, you know what I'm saying? Some niggas ain't got hearts, but hey, a lot of niggas... You know what I'm saying? Some people got conscious and they think about that shit. So when you take a motherfucker's life, think about you taking your own life and you pointing your own pistol to your motherfucking head and pulling that shit. He took yours. You take him. Ain't no turning back, man. Let him know. 
wait for her. Let him know. It's your time. You can't go out like that. You cannot go out like that. You scared? You scared? You scared? I want you to look into my eyes. Stop. I want you to look. I'm already dead. No. You took everything from no. me. I'm already dead inside. If you would know. Struggle, stop. And the pain. I'm not that I same went person anymore. For many stop. years, struggling on the streets while you fall out of control. I was homeless. I had to fend for myself. And now, I got the perfect revenge. You gotta tell your friends, stop. I got the perfect revenge now. <laughs> this isn't right. Who that? Giddy. 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 My advice to anybody doing this shit man you know what I'm saying just watch your back watch your motherfucking back cause there's plenty of niggas that be like hey them niggas are Jeff with you they will be like hey hey what's up what's up bro you got the plug what's up nigga you know you got all this money nigga I want in nigga hook me up hook me up but in reality man them niggas are some motherfucking snakes nigga they waiting for you to slip nigga they, they actually planning for your downfall my nigga they are you know what I'm saying? They planning for that shit. And, you know, you better keep your eyes open out here because niggas is, niggas is grinding, man. Those, those fucking, those fucking Hallmark smells, all that love and shit. Nah, nigga. Nah, ain't none of that. With me, man. You know, you got a lot of potential, man. I like your style. You got a lot of heart. You know what I'm saying? I fuck with number real motherfuckers no matter what, man. So I want you on my team, bro. I want you by my side, dude. That's why I hate motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? I want your homies for me, man. You know, just in case shit get out of line, you know? These motherfuckers is cool. I don't know if they that cool, you know? Got you. Motherfuckers, uh, look, look. Let me show you some shit. Let me show you some shit. Got some real deal shit right here, right. you know what I'm saying? Real deal cash, real deal motherfucking money. So we about to make this fucking drop right now. Nick Cecil, man. You know what I'm saying? This Nick Cecil we got the bread, man. You plug, you connect, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Shit, I got all this to reach the top, you know what I'm saying? What's up, I mean, that nigga Cole was good. Yeah, that nigga straight, you know what I'm saying? Numbers are right, you know what I'm saying? But we could be doing a lot better, that's what I'm saying. See this here, man? This ain't enough bread, you know? We could trying yeah. to get more, you know what I'm saying? I'm ready, man. You already yeah, know. know that. <laughs> you already know, man. So the main thing is, we get them the cash, they're going to give us all the dope, you know? They get the dope for us, you know? We use this to accumulate more of this shit. We want this shit to fill the top. We want, you know what I'm saying? This ain't enough. You let's, know? Get let's get it. Let's get it, baby. Let's get it. Come on, let's go. Got the strap. Got this shit, this shit. That's what I'm talking about, baby boy. Let's go. Oh. You good, my It's good, my nigga. It's crack. I see you crack, eating well. Man. Oh, yeah, 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 you know what I'm saying? Got to live, man. You don't work, you don't eat. Maybe I'm putting in the motherfucking baller, work. Baller. Yeah, right, right. Man, What's up? Yo. I'm fucking baller, You're the man, man of the hour, man. What's good, What's man? What's up, man? You say know? Some, man, you know. Hey, uh, hey, uh, man. I, I say, so who, who your boy you got with yeah, you? I see him in the good. with you, man. Uh, you know, you got to keep one of them motherfuckers around, man. One of them yeah, crazy I motherfuckers. You know what I'm You know, it's my homie right here, Crazy J. What's up, yo? What's the deal, Jay? Right, right, What's right. What's up, Jay? Right, right. Already, what up, man? All right, baby. Like we talked on the phone, man, you know? It's time to handle that business. And don't even worry about what happened to my boy over there. You know, he's, 
just got out of prison, you know. Yeah, man. You know what I'm, I'm saying? I was worried about your boy, man. Right, I'm right. Out, bro. I'm right. not good with you about that, man. Right, but you right. See what I'm saying things kind of got out of hand with your right, boy, you know right, what I'm saying? You got to stay in place, though. You got to put you know him up in place. Like, man. I wanted to holler at the boss. I don't know. So, man, what's up, man? What you got in the box, dog? I got in this box. Yeah, man, what you got? This is going to change us, man. This is going to put everybody on top. See, oh, we yeah. all gonna eat this shit. Y'all. Uh, right. You gonna eat, you gonna eat, y'all gonna eat. We're gonna take over the city. What's in this box, we gonna double it. You know yeah, what I'm what's saying? In box. Yeah. What's in the box? What's in the box? And then what's the Oh, yeah, man. Jackpot, 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 so how much of that is mine? How much of this is mine? I'm gonna tell y'all the game plan. I'm gonna tell y'all the game plan. Shout out the game. What we gonna do with this? We're gonna flip it. I'm gonna let you guys get this. I'm gonna have you connect with power on the front. You met him. Boy with the bin. Count that, bro. Count, yeah, that count, shit. count all that count shit, that, baby. Bro. That's real money. What it is, man. So I want you to drop. Working with you. I want you to drop these off to Pablo. Get the dope. Get the dope, and we're gonna double it. You know what I'm saying? The main goal is to triple this. You know, we want to triple these stacks so we can all eat. This is enough for maybe three motherfuckers, but we want to all eat. You know what I'm saying? We want to we want to sack this motherfucker to the ceiling. I don't like this motherfucker. He already counting it. He already counting the motherfucking money. Yeah. So the main goal is, All right. I'm going to drop this pack <laughs> off to you, man. We're going to meet up later, man. Back. Pablo's already ready. Yeah, I already bro. made a phone no, call to him. Just so leave that open, sis. Right. Just leave right. that open, sis. Once we get the dope, yeah, right. no, man, all you guys get it. We're going to double up. We're going to take over the motherfucking city, baby. So, man, I was thinking about the East Coast, you know what I'm saying? I can get in on that, you know what I'm saying? Now that we moving around the town, you know what I mean? And my, I got people everywhere, you know what I mean? Willing to do whatever, you know what I mean? Shit, so, hey, on the East Coast, we're about to get down. On the West Coast, we got it blocked. We're about to go north. We're about to go to the south with it. Right, right. So, what's up, man? You man, think about that, man? I think it's great, but I think the main goal is to expand. You know, loyalty is everything, like I said, man. I got to make moves. I'm going to meet up with y'all later. Oh, look, we already getting a call, bro. Uh, your boy getting the call. You already getting the call. Yeah. Bro. About to make moves. We're gonna meet up with y'all later down on down in seven. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Down Let's seven. Do that, man. You right know by, that. right by the, the freeway. You know what I'm saying? Already, right by man. the freeway. Already, man. Make sure, make sure you have that dope for me, man, so we can double up. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Already, I'm putting my bro. trust. I'm putting my you heart know. into you, baby. You know what I'm saying? I you trust, trust us. Yeah. You trust us. Yeah. I'm gonna never let you down, Cecil. Yeah. What's up? Yeah. I say everything, y'all. I say everything. Let's go, let's go. What's going on, brother? What's up, man? What's good? What's good? Let's finish the crowd, man. You know what I'm saying? Loyalty, like I'm telling, man. Loyalty is everything. You know, there's some crazy motherfuckers out here that do anything for the money. You know what I'm saying? But I know these motherfuckers is loyal. They a hundred, you know? That's why I'm putting my trust into them. You gotta go? Love, man. Man. I blow you and let him out. <laughs> you know what it is? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. What's up with it, cuz? Is that oh. nail? See, I, that's that's one of my fam models right there. He out of town, man. You already know what's popping. Say what's up, cuz. What's up with it, man? Tell them niggas what it is, man. Tell them niggas what it is, man. Man, you already know, man. Hey, you know we eating over here, boy. Cuz, look. Cuz, look. Cuz, look, I told you you was going to get that pack, hey, boy. Look, bro. That's how we doing That's it, baby. That's how we doing it, boy. That's how we do it. That's how we do it down here, man. You sound man. crazy, man. Open that up one more time for this man, man. You remember that nigga I was telling you about? You remember, you remember that that Cecil? You remember that nigga Cecil, bro? We playing bro? out here. You, Look at all this. You remember that nigga Cecil, bro? In, in two minutes. Hey, you know what hey. I'm saying? Bro, two you remember minutes. that nigga Cecil, bro? Hey, cuz. You must be down. Huh? You see that? I do. I, I do this for real. You remember I that nigga Cecil? Yeah, 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 yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's us. Hey, hey, you hey. feel me? It's us. Hey, for that. Hey, 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 man. We telling you, man. T look, get that nigga face. Look, we do this for real, man. That's from the homie you know Cecil, man.
Killer City. Yeah. Say it one more time, do. fam. Say it one more time. Yeah, yeah, man. Real shit. Tell that nigga Cecil, man. We about to come up. We about to come up. Already. You know we eat, boy. Gonna push this shit to Pablo, man. Like, like, and like the homie Cecil said, man. Push it to Pablo. Push that shit. Triple this. Probably quadruple it. Hey, hey, but check it. You see how that nigga was coming up like he just all bossed out and cool and shit like he can't be touched. Yeah. Y'all pick that shit out. Like we low niggas or something, bro. I that shit out, or like, bro. like he only want to give us what he want us to give. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm does. saying, bro. You know what I'm saying? Cause and I know y'all got the Drake. It's grimy out here. Y'all got the Drake. We got the little know. AR in the motherfucking shit. forty and shit. Yep. You know and shit, bro. We got the Sig and shit with the thirties and shit, and fifties and hundreds and shit. So, see, I'm a cusp. Man, I think we should just go ahead and get this nigga, get man. Get this nigga, this nigga one get time, him out. bro. Get him out, you know what I'm saying? We got on. shit going on. And then yeah. we be the connect for Pablo. Yeah. We'll be the we'll be <laughs> <up>. <laughs> Nigga, I'm down, nigga. What's up? Already. Right. We're going to get Already. it. Already. Already. What it is. Looking back at things. Shit. I thought I was untouchable. I thought I was on top of the world. Man, it's funny how you could be blinded by money and power. It blinds you. It eats away in you. It eats away at your very soul. Nigga, sis, I ain't got none of this shit, man. Yeah, right now, man. All right, now we holding it down, man. We taking over the town, you know. Yeah, bro. Shit, man. We got this money, bro. Hey, man. I told you, man, we got different plans, man. We got different plans, man. You know what I'm saying, bro? Hit this nigga, man. Had to take this shit. I mean, fuck that nigga, man. We about to take over the city, man. Take a look at the city, man. Take a look at the city, man. Hey, man, we about to take over this shit, y'all. You get nothing back, bro. You can count that shit out, bro. Fuck that nigga, bro. Fuck that nigga, man. I'm about to call this shit right now, you dig it? It's called right now, man. Bro. Yeah, bro, we here, man. We ready, bro. You ready? Shit, man. You already know, man. We got everything ready. All right. I see y'all in a minute. Y'all know what to do. All ready, man. Honey, y'all got it? Yeah, I think. All right. Well, honey. All right. Go meet up with sister, man. Yeah, I'm here. Nah, nah. Hey, hey what's up with all the stuttering shit? Real motherfuckers, we handle real business. Now, I don't like that motherfucking stutter and shit, man. You sounded cool when we was in, everything was all great. Did I tell you it's all about motherfucking loyalty? Listen, did you get the packs? Did you get the fucking packs? No, no, fuck that. Where are you? Where are you? I'm in the location you told me about. Where are you? Listen, listen, you got five fucking minutes. You got five fucking, you got four fucking minutes. Listen, if you don't show up right now, this is gonna be my fucking war. I'm not fucking playing. Where the fuck are you? What's up, man? What's up, man? Nigga, bread, man. What the fuck is up, man? Huh? I'm not worried about the motherfucking bread. I'm worried about the packs. Man, Did you get the packs, dog? Okay. Yeah, what's up, bro? I'm not fucking with you. Really? Motherfucker! We're running this shit! You ain't doing shit, dog! You hear me? You hear me? You hear me, dog? Huh? Fuck! We're running this shit! You really? We don't run shit! You really want that power that much? What? You really want that power that much? Fuck! 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 Fu
really want that motherfucking power that much. What the fuck you gonna do? Man, we taking this shit off. You hear me? You motherfucker. We taking this shit off. You and your motherfucking clicks are all busted. What you want? Bring him over here. Bring that motherfucker over here. Say something now, huh? What? Huh? Do what you gonna do now, Caesar? Huh? The fuck you gonna do? You hear me, dog? I swear. You hear me talking to you, boy? I swear on my fucking life that you motherfuckers are all gonna pay for us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Go to sleep, boy. Swear what? Do you hear me, boy? Yeah. Swear what? Yeah. Yeah. Shit. Season. We just gonna take everything you got, you dig it? And take over the city, you dig it? Nah, nigga, you go to fuckers. Yeah. You motherfuckers. Yeah. And you gonna yeah. introduce us to Pablo, nigga. Right like that, motherfucker. And, and you gonna play that shit cool, say nigga. Say body family, you too, homeboy. You gonna play that boy. shit cool, yeah. you yeah. say body your family, yeah. homeboy. You motherfucker! Make sure we straight. Make sure we good. Yeah, this motherfucker's still breathing. Yeah, we'll let you live this time, boy. Run this fuck this nigga. Run this nigga pockets, what the fuck? Yeah. Yeah, got the shit we need. We got everything we need now, Cesar. Look at you now. Fuck you gonna do now? Huh? No, yeah, that shit got no motherfucking gun. We took your shit. Took all your shit. No way, homeboy. Go to sleep, homie. Answer machine again, I gotta call this one. God damn, Cecil, pick up the fucking phone!
Shit, I'll have him knock the fuck off. By any means necessary. Any means necessary. You know, um. Shit. I had beef with a lot of motherfuckers. A lot. A lot of motherfuckers, you know, um. It was crazy. I was always paranoid and shit. Always uh, putting trust in the wrong people, expecting loyalty. But I ain't get shit back. With a fucking boot to my face. And down there, fucking killed. You know? Just put my trust in the wrong fucking people. Everybody ain't loyal. Everybody ain't your friend. And shit. There's times I fucking paid the ultimate price for that shit. But believe me, whoever fucked me over, I got revenge. It was like that. An eye for a fucking eye, you know? None of that bullshit you talking about, all I want to know is when you pulling up so I can get some more guns. You know what I'm saying? You supposed to be here three hours ago. The fuck is you doing, man? You make me want to fuck around and do some shit I'm going to regret, nigga. You know what I'm saying? I might up this motherfucker on your ass. No, 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 don't play with me. Make sure you get my motherfucking guns in, bro. I've been waiting three and a half hours now, nigga. Give me my shit before I blow your shit. I'm not fucking around, man. I got motherfuckers that depend on me. You know what I'm saying? For they protection. So just know, man, I need this shit. I need this shit in right fucking now, man. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to, man. Just let me know. How far is you right now, man? How far is you, man? I need to know right now. You know, I fuck with real bangers, nigga. Cecil, you know what I'm saying? So what he ain't blood gang, nigga? So everywhere I go, you know, I, I, I fucks with the Crips, with the Brips, you know what I'm saying? I, I fucks with a few of them. Cecil's one of them guys, man. If you got a problem with that, you know how I'm rocking, you know where I stay, you know where I be at. So nigga, just pull up. Matter of fact, you should be pulling up so you can get this money, nigga. I don't know why you keep playing with me, playing with my emotions. Cecil, nigga. Cecil world out here. You know what I'm saying? I'm rocking with my brother, rocking with my cousin, you know how we coming. So I don't want to hear that bullshit you talking about. You know what I'm saying? Just let me know when you here with the shit, and we gon' we gon' we gon' get this shit done. In and out, in and out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's my nigga Cecil outside. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I'm about to let him in right now. What's up, Cecil? What's up, B? What's up? What's up, B, man? You know how I been, man. How you doing, baby? You gotta show me some love, man. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I see you. Yeah, come on over, man. Come on over. Yeah, bro. I've been calling you, man. Shit, man. Good looking out, fam. Hey, man. You know, you know I got you, bro. I need that protection. You know what I'm saying? A couple of motherfuckers been hating on me. You know? I gotta do what I gotta do. You know what I'm saying? They been hating on me and D Train. They hate that we're getting this money. It's too many fucking haters out here. You know, motherfuckers get jealous when they see you on top. My thing is, I wanna stay at the top. Motherfucker, I don't wanna get caught slipping. You see this motherfucker right here? It's not enough. I need that big shit, bro. I need that big shit sword you got. You know what I'm saying? That's why I came to you. I know you got the motherfucking plug and you don't take no shit. You a live wire just like me. You're crazy. Crazy motherfucker. And I need that. I need motherfuckers like you on my team, baby. Because I guarantee you, if these motherfuckers keep hating on me and fucking D-Train, we're going to go to war. I want you by my side. Yeah, I got the guns, man. I got it all, bro. Yeah, baby, let's go. Yeah, yeah. Anything you need. I got, I got, I got shorties. I got long ones. I got tall ones. We got it all. Every day. Don't worry, my brother. I got a couple stacks for you, too. Yeah, man. Like I said, man, I got everything you need, man. I got a little daddy right here. This shit's nice. A little 40, you know. You and D-Train. Y'all can use this, share this, you know. You know, you saying the niggas was hating on you, plotting on you like 20, 30 niggas, man. Fuck them, man. You already know, man. I ain't going out like that. I ain't going to let you guys go out like that. That's why I brought titties with me. I ain't get you the little 30, you know, I bought the whole thing. So, you know, if the nigga ever go crazy, I mean, ever go crazy, 
You know we upping it on them niggas. I don't give a fuck who they are. They better recognize who the fuck we Boy, I'm telling you, man, they don't know how we coming, man. I'm telling you, man, we'll come, we'll blow these niggas, you know what I'm saying? Bang, bang, bang! That's You know what I'm saying? We keep blasting, keep blasting. You know what I'm saying? They gonna know who we are. When they see this shit, they gonna be pissing their pants. They gonna wish they never fuck with you or a D train. They gonna know we don't fuck around over here. You know what I'm saying? In any territory, we go to any block, any neighborhood, anybody. We take it everything. You know what I'm saying? That's how we do it. You know? So I got you. I got you, man. Yeah. They wanna get at us? They know what to do. They know exactly. I've been having dreams. I've been waking up with my heart racing. My soul shaking. I can't have that. I've been having dreams of death. I've been having dreams of a jealous motherfucker taking me out the game. I've been having dreams of motherfucker killing me. See, Sarge, I can't have that. I have those dreams no more, Sarge. That's why I need you. Right, that's why I need these fucking guns, baby. Cause I know it's gonna go down. Any given moment, it's gonna go down. I got you, season man. They fucking with you. They fucking with me. You know what I'm saying? Fuck them. You know what I'm saying, season? So you know, I got this. I got this nice, nice place. You know what I'm saying? It's 50 per side. It's it knocking nigga off, you know what I'm saying? It just goes. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Just go crazy, you know? You know what I'm saying? You know, I, like I said, I keep this bad boy too season. Cause I don't fuck around. Season. Like, nigga, every trial. Every trial. I'm telling you, always lock. And I'm always lock. Oh uh, yeah, Shh. there was a time where I did escape from this motherfucker, man. And you know where I went? I went right over to my boy D's train's house and I got back up on the motherfucking streets. You know what I'm saying? I was back in the motherfucker grinding hard. What's up, my man? How you doing, bro? Man, finally got that motherfucking joint, baby. Uh, yeah, you know what I'm saying? You gonna stay out? I don't know, man. The goal is not to go back in. The goal is to get this that's, rip. So I'm going to hit you up whenever I stack up, baby. That's what I want to hear. That's what I want to hear. Fuck the cops, right. baby. That's on my soul. That's on my soul. That's on my soul. That's on my soul, nigga. That's on my soul. That's on my soul, nigga. Nigga, I know what it is about me. That's on my soul. I don't rock with none of y'all pussy niggas who be faking that's all That's on my soul. I don't rock with none of y'all pussy niggas who be faking that's all roll. I'ma put it down and I'ma rep for the town, nigga, that's how I go And if you got a problem, nigga, you can blame it on my fam, that's all I know It's the driver, that's all I know 
Nigga. I'm one of the real, I really be living by loyalty, you see it all in my face Niggas that tell you I never been selfish, you call on the driver and I'm on the way I ask you no questions unless I'm trying to figure out if I gotta pull up with the K Other than that, it ain't nothing to say If I gave you my word, I'm with you to the face that don't in my way The driver gon' stay in this lane and the thing that can change that And shit, I put that on my name cause I'm real and I hate it when niggas don't stay facts on my mom. I gotta get off these fucking streets, man. It's too hot. It's too hot, man. I need a place to go. I need to take these fucking rags off, man. And definitely, I need some more motherfucking work. Cause you know me, I gotta bounce back. These fucking feds can't hold me, man. Damn, Cecil, man, you been gone a long time, man. When you touch down, man. man. <laughs> okay, okay. Yeah, but I'm trying to get back on the motherfucking grind, though, man. All right, man. That's all I know. 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 That's
fucking cycle that will never stop and it's up to you whether to break that cycle in your life because if you don't you're just gonna be stuck in a complete pattern of just nothing bullshit bullshit man i think the hardest part being in this motherfucker it's just not seeing your family members especially if you got a son or a daughter <laughs> shit you know what I'm saying? It's almost like you try not to think about it, but, you know, your son or daughter is a piece of part of you. You know, it's it's a piece of you, so she or he is a piece of you, so shit, it's hard not to think, man. It's almost like you got to cut off all ties to society, man. You might as well just be dead in here. And this motherfucker, man, you ain't nothing but a number. It's almost like you dead to the world. And, you know, don't get me wrong, those first couple of years, you will get notes, you will get messages, and all that other great shit from family and close, close friends. But in the long run, that shit slowly dies down. And you just, like, God damn, man, what the fuck? You know what I'm saying? Where everybody go? And you ain't got nobody, you know? And that's the sad thing about it. You ain't got nobody. Especially if you come in this motherfucker at a young age. Shit, this is all you gonna know. And um, I'm doing life. But there's motherfuckers in here doing like 20, 30 years, and that's still a long motherfucking time. You know what I'm saying? It's just hopefully the motherfuckers that at least have a chance of parole, they could somewhat, hopefully, they could change with inside prison. You know what I'm saying? They could develop a skill, a trait, find God. I know a lot of religious motherfuckers in here. You know what I'm saying? You know, that's them. Um, do I have any regrets for what I did, murdering motherfuckers, doing all this shit to a certain extent? But, hey, you know, um, it is what it is. Can't nothing change that. Can't nothing bring them niggas back. I didn't fucking murder. I didn't kill. You know, so many crime scenes that were manifested in the city because of me and my fucking crew. Can we bring those lives back? No, we can't. You know what I'm saying? So it's like shit, you know, in the long run, uh, God's going to have his way with me. You know what I'm saying? Uh, man can lock me up, you know what I'm saying? But it's up to me to uh, repent and realize my mistakes. So I'm talking to you motherfuckers just to let you know, you know, um, just to tell my story and let you know that uh, this shit ain't right, man. This shit ain't right. You know what I'm saying? Um the jewelry, the gold, the money, the women, all all that shit, you know, uh, just shit, man, uh, it ain't worth it, man, coming from me, Cecil Ducksworth, who actually spent time in this motherfucker, I ain't never getting out, no chance of uh, fucking parole, <sighs> shit, but, um, yeah, it's tough, I said what the fuck I had to say. Um, I hope you motherfuckers got something out of this. If you didn't, God bless you. You know what I'm saying? I try to help. I'm, a conti I'm, a, I'm going to continue to tell my motherfucking story. And it's up to you niggas whether or not to listen or not. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm in here for life. And uh, the most I can do now is tell my story. And just let you niggas know what's up. The gang don't love you. These bitches don't love you. Your money don't love you. Your fancy car don't love you. Your house that you buying all this materialistic bullshit don't love you. You know what I'm saying? Love yourself. And the only way to love yourself is to take care of yourself and do the motherfucking right thing by staying off these fucking streets and stop dealing with these bitch ass niggas and these bitches out here that want to set you up. You know what I'm saying? I'm out.